Hey guys, so today I wanted to make a video showing you the perfumes that I wouldn't repurchase, at least for right now. So I'm gonna start with Black Opium. I have the one ounce in here. And I'm not saying that this smells bad, but it smells a little bit mature to me. And I don't think it goes well with me right now. So maybe in the future, because it doesn't smell bad to me. Um, but at this time, at this point in my life, I don't think I would run to get it again. I will, of course, use it up because it's literally new. I think I just used it two times. Um, and then I wouldn't repurchase it for a while. The next one that I wouldn't repurchase is this Victor & Roth Bonbon. So this is a very popular, very expensive perfume. I got it because of all the reviews that I saw about it. It was supposed to be super sweet, like a caramel bomb, you know, <laughs> and I was sold. So I got it and it's not what I thought it was going to be. To me, it just smells pretty, um, but nothing too special. So of course I'm going to use it up because I, I bought it. As you can see, the liquid is like right here. I am going to use it up, but I'm not going to repurchase this. The next one that I'm not going to repurchase is Sweet Like Candy by Ariana Grande. So this smells really good, don't get me wrong, but I do prefer the original Ari. Um, they don't last as long, but just because of the scent, I will stick with the original and leave this one behind. Like, Of course, I'm going to use it up. It's like right here, the liquid, but... I don't think that I'm gonna repurchase it. The next one that I wouldn't repurchase is Daisy Love by Mar Jacobs. I don't have the cap on because to me the cap is just <laughs> obnoxious. It's a big flower in here and it occupies more space than if I just put it in here without the cap. So I took the cap off and as you can see this is pretty much full. So the liquid is like right here. I've used this a couple of times and I bought it because I saw a review that literally sold me. I, I saw a review about this girl. She said that she used that at her workplace and it lasted a long time, that it was super sweet, warm, cozy. And I do get that from it. It's just, it. it's not interesting enough for me to repurchase it again this is a very expensive perfume and i think that it's just not for me i do think it's comfy it's more of a skin scent to me i don't get a huge like siage or a perfume trail behind me or anything um so yeah it, when i use perfumes i want them to have good projection good lasting time and i just don't get this from it the next one is Victoria's Secret Teas. It smells really good, but it reminds me a lot of Viva La Juicy Original. And I love that one. And to me, this barely lasts on my skin. It's very expensive. And I can get the Viva La Juicy discounted for less. Um, and I love that one on my body chemistry. With my body chemistry, Viva La Juicy is better. So yeah. As you can see, I did use quite a bit of it. I bought this oops, I bought this in September 2021 for my birthday. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to use this up, but no, I wouldn't repurchase it. And then something that I'm kind of sad about is this. This is Viva La Juicy Bodacious. As you can see, I'm like almost halfway through the bottle. So this is a discontinued fragrance that you can still get here and there, but it doesn't last. And this smells divine. To me, this smells like a piña colada, but it doesn't last. And it, it's not like it costs only 20 bucks. Like, it is a little bit expensive. And for something that doesn't last, even if it smells amazing, I just, no, I wouldn't repurchase it. So when I'm done with it, I might cry a little bit, but no, I won't repurchase this one. 
unless I find it like super discounted. I'm talking $30, $20. And that is it, guys. These are my six fragrances that I wouldn't repurchase um, Basically, most of them smell good. It's just that the lasting power is not there or like black opium is just a little bit too mature for me right now. Um, but to me, they don't smell bad because if they smell bad, I wouldn't have them in my collection. So yeah, thank you for watching this video, guys. See you on my next one. Bye-bye.